Hey everybody, uh, I wanted to talk to you a little bit about what I've been working on in the background. Uh, I've been on the road now for 26 days. Uh, I had one day in a campsite and I purposely made a decision. I was not going to use their, their bathroom, I need to test Cuddy to his maximum. Uh, but I have to say it was lovely to get a hot shower, recharge the batteries and actually just relax a little bit. Recently we've been testing out the electrical connectivity for Cuddy. So the request was, hey, we're going to make him water resistant. Awesome. How do we do that? If it was a factory install, um, you could wire him internally, but we want to make sure that you can fit him in your van yourself. And we were looking at uh, connectors that enable you to do this, waterproof, water resistant, waterproof connectors that enable you to do this. Uh, currently we're testing this guy here. Uh, that is an AMP super seal, I believe. So it comes apart like this. And you can see clips in. So this is my setup in my van. Out he comes. This is the connector. Normally I keep that at the back. But look at this. Cuddy off. Cuddy on. Cuddy off. Cuddy on. And that's it. Here we go buddy. Okay so this is what the connector looks like um, before you have put it together and assembled it. Uh, you've got the main body of the connector here that will snap together. And what these connectors here are, are to connect the wires. These are waterproof seals that will go over the wire uh, when you connect it. And they look like this when, uh, when they're assembled. And the wire will come in here. This is crimped around it. And the actual wire is crimped just here in the middle um, to make it nice and waterproof. So not only is this connection waterproof here, each individual wire is connected and waterproof as well. We want to make sure we can choose a connector that people can use even if they don't have the official tools and I believe this may be one of the solutions. We also don't want a very large bulky connector and we'll be showing you a comparison that we're currently evaluating as well. So there you got it. These are the AMP Super Seal connectors that we're currently planning for Cuddy. Let us know what you think. They currently take 16 AWG wire or 1.5 millimeter squared let us know what you think about that. We chose that size because it's reasonably substantial in order to take the vibrations and wear and tear of bending around your chassis on your van or your boat and rubbing up against stuff as you're driving along or motoring along or sailing along. The fan itself is going to take a really low amount of energy. It's like 0.1 amps or less. It's even 16 AWG wire is going to be sufficient for it. In terms of fuse, because we've had that question as well, no more than an amp no more than half an amp if you can get it one of those fuses okay that's it guys uh, let us know what you think about 16 awg wire or 0.1 millimeter squared we'd love to know your thoughts if you worked with these super seal connectors before let us know if they're good if they're bad if you've got a better suggestion but we're going to try and make cutty as amazing as possible thanks everybody